change 5 over 11 into an equivalent fraction with the denominator 44. Divide 44 by 11 to get 4. Then multiply 5 by 4 to get 20. Let's look at the next example. Change 3 over 7 into an equivalent fraction with the denominator 35. 35 divided by 7 is 5. So 7 times 5 is 35. To get an equivalent fraction, we have to multiply the numerator as well by 5. So 3 times 5 is 15. We see that dividing 15 by 5 and 35 dividing by 5 results in our original fraction. Remember, raising fractions to higher terms is the opposite of reducing fractions to lower terms. Let's do another example. Change 1 over 2 into an equivalent fraction with the denominator 20. Ask yourself, 2 times what is 20? 2 times 10 equals 20 and 1 times 10 equals 10. What about this one? Change 3 over 4 to a fraction with 20 in the denominator. 4 times what equals 20? 4 times 5 equals 20 and 3 times 5 equals 15. Change 7 over 8 to a fraction with 32 in the denominator. Feel free to pause the video and try it by yourself. 8 times what is 32? 8 times 4 is 32. So 7 times 4 is 28. One over three is equal to what over 57? Feel free to pause the video and try it by yourself. Three times 19 is 57 and one times 19 is 19. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments. This video is what I did for you. If you want to do something for me, hit the bell button, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching and happy learning everyone.